Hi, I'm Danny Jakubowski with the Abu Dhabi Golf Institute by Touring Golf. Today I'm going to talk to you about one simple tip or one simple drill that's going to help you regulate and check the path of your club going back and on the way through. Okay, so one of the things that most club golfers misinterpret is the path that the golf club should take. Now what you'll see is I've put a line down or a rod, an alignment stick that indicates the angle of my shaft at address, okay, when we take our stance. Now most golfers have a tendency to swing too much underneath and then around that shaft line, which promotes either a, a slice shot, or if they do it the other way, it produces a, a push or a, or a draw shot. What I want to show you is, A, what it should look like, and B, a simple drill that you could do on the driving range to help the path of your club. The first thing I want you to notice is when I take the club away, I'm taking it away the same angle as the rod that I've set up. So the club is following the path that I started with. Then when I hinge my hands, you'll see that my hands here should probably be about shoulder height and the angle of the club is represented by the same angle that I started with. Now if I switch that club through, you'll see that that angle is retained again. This is good path for the golf club. Okay, so here's something you can do very simply on the driving range and if you're one of those golfers that has the big staff bag like the tour professionals, I suggest buying a carry bag because it has quite a few purposes. What you can do is set the angle of your carry bag the same angle as the shaft at address, okay? Now if it's a three iron or a driver, then you can quite simply adjust the angle of your carry bag. If you rehearse two moves in particular, the takeaway, the hinge, and then the swish through, you'll be able to follow that angle with more ease. Plus by having the bag there, it'll give you an indication if you're not making the correct angles during your swing. So in conclusion, you may not be able to move your body the same way that Tiger Woods and Rory McIlroy do, but by using that simple drill, you'll be able to effectively control the path of your golf club and hopefully reduce your scores in the process.